Look at this fucking thing. So we'll be using this today. This is a realistic How digital old is that AF. Thing? It's probably older than you are. This is our record button here. Um, it use, uses something called tapes, 8 millimeter tapes. Camera of choice, guys. One lens fits all, that's it. That's all you get is one lens. Oh, and make sure you pack extra batteries, too. <laughs> hey, dude. Packing the stuff up, getting ready to shoot. Day one, just doing producery things. What's that address again? Uh, well, I started off this morning with this big manly beard and they told me to shave it off and then I've already bled for this role. <laughs> um, it's eight now. We should be on the road, but our main actor, um, who's playing Rambro. I'm Travis playing the role of Rambro. Decided to kind of just not show up today. I don't know what the f*** we're going to do. Try to call him right now, see what happens. Again. No answer? Alright, Rusty, it's gonna have to be you, dude. Alright. Mm. Yeah, dude, see what's up with that. He's not picking up my phone calls. Right. Hello! I <laughs> <laughs> overslept! We just showed up, getting Mr. T uh, into his gear. You feeling like Mr. T? <laughs> we got some of the bad guys going. I'm the bad guy. Because Rambro still is MIA. Oh, Travis playing a role. Rambo. And then, and then we do like subtitles, right? Mm -hmm, huh? Yeah, and then it's like, yeah, so what do you think? <laughs> So I can kind of improv every once in a while now. So hey, what yeah. you say? Yeah, and you're like, <laughs> yeah. You never understand what that fool said. The hell you saying, fool? <laughs> what do you think, Justin? Like the, the first line that you were saying. Okay, so. we'll, we'll we'll give it a shot. Yeah. <laughs> Feel like a, like a little kid getting into his dad's clothes. Here's Rambo. Here's the new. Here's the new one that we. Uh, the new skinny Rambo. Oh, Travis playing the role of Rambo. Viral. Mm -hmm. Did any, anybody ever teach you how to, you know? This is where the viewers get to first see Rambo and be Abro Rockus uh, right before they start an incredible amount of kick assness, and uh, so we, uh, you've probably seen earlier in the BTS. Uh, had a last minute change uh, with Rambro, so we're suiting up here and getting ready to go kick some ass. Get start to get weird, like, yeah, Rambro! Uh, uh, uh. There's more, dude, here comes way more, and there's like. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> it's the train back home again, that's where you find me waiting. I'm the bad guy. Purpose is about to stick three sticks of dynamite up this chicken's uh, orifice. <laughs> Not really going any further than that. Keep going. <laughs> there it goes. All right. You know what we should try to do? It's really long. <laughs> <laughs> So we're back here for the uh, 19th hundred time. This is this is where we film. We don't go nowhere else. We're... I love pickups because you get to come back and do all the shit you didn't do day one. Filming some of the thugs get shot and getting attacked by bugs. Did I get that guy? <laughs> so here we go. More stuff to get. Let's go. Got the TNT. Do anything from some TNT. So we are going, we're clearing bushes um, to open up some room for a flamethrower shot. BA is about to run up this hill right here. Show that. He's going to be running up and then he'll point uh, point the and toast our thug dude over here. Cool. Oh! Kentucky Fried!
God, sucker! Kentucky Fried Sucker. Kentucky Fried Sucker. Love that. Sucker. Love that. All right, so what we're doing now, uh, just getting ready to suit up Jonathan here as the suicide bomb vest guy. Not something you do on a typical Sunday, but uh, here in Forge House Films, just another day. Instead of a life jacket, it's a death jacket. So we've got our dynamites here. He's got his dead man stick, uh, which we did a really dangerous search online for suicide bomb vests. I'm sure we made a few lists with that one. For those that may not know, uh, suicide guys, because they're jerks, they hold on to that so if they get shot, uh, as soon as they let go, the bomb goes off. Uh, these are made out of basically, I think it was a one inch dowel rod. Um, we wrapped them, uh, painted them, printed these stickers out. The stickers don't look so great up close, but from a distance they look really good. Uh, and then we wrapped it in um, wax paper, which was a suggestion of a friend of mine. Thank you, Clayton. Um, and it looks great. You ready to die? I am. It is a good day to die. Hold. And action. Hit! It's ridiculous. Yeah. Was he doing his interview in Rambro? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> American guns. It's heavy. Rambro dude. wants a communist I'm telling gun. You, honestly. That's why I'm not holding this right now. It's too damn heavy. I'm making this monster red. And it looks easy, but to make it super even is kind of difficult. And you're using your finger? Yeah, I think I could blend it better with my finger than this stupid tool. Even though my finger hurts. <laughs> Brittany Corbell, the newscaster. Are you laughing at First that? acting gig ever? Yeah, because you never let me be in any of your films. Team Bro Force is being airlifted out. Reset. Back home to safety. Let's take a look. I don't like any of them. I think the other ones were good. All right, we're know. cutting. We're giving up. I'm not gonna do it anymore. Mm -hmm. So knowing that that Broforce had a ton of VFX, just these super crazy flamethrower shots, I knew I, I knew that a I was either gonna have to learn how to create flamethrower fire and fume effects, um, or I was gonna get some help and. Because we really want to create content on a regular basis on YouTube, um, I reached out for help and I found a fellow by the name of Tyree Bonois. Sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. I'm gonna put his name, I'm gonna spell it out. He had lots of cool videos of his simulations that he's done in the past, great stuff. Um, reached out and he was more than happy to help us out with a lot of the shots, so. <laughs> awesome and you know we really appreciate everything that he's done for us um, <clears throat> check him out check him out on Vimeo check him out on uh, his YouTube channel um, he's a really good guy um, awesome talent good stuff I created some of the bullet hits um, in fume effects which came out really nice 3d is kind of something new that I'm, I'm getting into but I thought it came out really cool hope you guys enjoyed team bro force it was fun. It was so much fun making it. You guys are definitely going to want to subscribe and stay in the loop. Can't wait to get to our next project. Thanks for watching, guys. That was good. I felt that one. I think we're done. Heck yeah. That was, yeah, 100%. Professional.